Ramadan Mubarak to all my Muslim brothers and sisters. This beautiful month, it's one of our favorite months. Personally, it's one of my favorite months. I pray for Allah's guidance throughout this month. Many started the year with us, but didn't get the privilege of seeing this month. So if you are alive today, you are healthy, and you are observing this holy month, you should say Alhamdulillah, because it's one of the biggest blessings you can ever get from Allah. My little advice to my Muslim brothers and sisters is to try as much as possible to make the best out of this month. Do your best to refrain from listening to music. Try as much as possible to refrain from foul languages, dirty languages, insults, any vulgar language that is going to trigger your brother or sister, either in Islam or not. Try as much as possible not to harbor any kind of hatred, probably from the past. If you have any hatred, anyone has hurt you one way or the other, you have any kind of anger issue towards your brother, your sister, your friend, your sibling, family or not, try as much as possible in this holy month to forgive. Yes, sometimes forgiveness is very hard, but if you want Allah to forgive you and accept your supplications this Ramadan, try as much as possible to forgive your neighbors and love them just as you love yourself. Within the hours of Ramadan, try to restrain from going to places such as the nightclubs, places such as the bars, places that's going to temper with your fast. Try to refrain from places like that places that you're going to sit and then gossip talk about people issues that do not concern you try as much as possible to refrain from things like that do more prayers don't miss your prayer pray on time if you are the type who does not pray regularly try as much as possible for the sake of this holy man perhaps Allah is going to accept your prayers and your supplication whatever that on your heart Allah is going to accept it try your possible best to pray on time very very important when it's time for prayers don't give any excuse at least for the sake of this month don't give any excuse excuses pray on time very important do more giving yes give more and receive less if you have a neighbor who is a muslim try as much as possible to invite your neighbor or send some good tidings some food to your neighbor when it's time to break your fast always make sure you get the best out of this ramadan recite your quran go to the mocks as much as you can make sure you are keeping your best make sure you are giving your best during this ramadan because you may never know this might be your very last ramadan on earth you may never know so make the best out of this Ramadan. My prayer for you today, this Ramadan, may Allah accept your secret prayers, whatever has been on your heart for long, whatever you are yearning for, whatever you've been praying for years, those who are seeking for the fruit of the womb, those who want marriages, those who want jobs, those who need healing, who are on the hospital bed and need healing, whatever it is that you are facing in your life. I'm taking this advantage from my mouth to God's ears. May Allah accept your prayers for the sake of this Ramadan. I pray you find peace, love and light in everything that you do. On behalf of myself and my entire team, I would want to say Ramadan Mubarak once again. And it is my prayer that we see many more Ramadan, inshallah, Ramadan Mubarak once again.